Tesla Optimus is currently considered the most worthwhile humanoid robot to purchase. With its flexibility, affordability, cost efficiency, and support for home-based businesses, it can generate significant income, up to thousands of dollars per month, with just one humanoid robot. While there have been some doubts about the release of Optimus by the end of this year, the reasons we outline below will confirm that anything is possible. So why will Tesla Bot be a multi-purpose homemaker? That's what we'll dive into in today's episode. And welcome to Techno Creators. Before we begin, please help us reach 4,500 subscribers. It will be a huge motivation for us to continue bringing you great tech episodes. Elon Musk has said that everyone wants to have one, or even more than one, to talk about the efficiency it brings, whether they are factory workers or homemakers. First, let's talk about homemakers, because we believe this will be the main direction where Elon Musk will invest more in his robots. You know, no one is foolish enough to buy a robot that can only perform tasks inside a factory. Unlike human labor, a standard robot can operate continuously throughout the day without needing rest or breaks. Tesla has integrated a 52-volt, 2.3-kilowatt-hour battery pack into Optimus Gen 1, allowing it to run continuously without frequent recharging. Although information about upgrading the battery pack in the Gen 2 version has not yet been confirmed, it may not be necessary as the weight of Optimus Gen 3 has been reduced. Now only 138 pounds compared to Gen 1's 160 pounds. Therefore, maintaining the 2.3 kilowatt hour battery pack seems reasonable. And don't forget, it can carry loads of up to 45 pounds. With such a large capacity, the tasks that Tesla Optimus can perform as a homemaker are not limited to cleaning the house and simple physical chores. With flexible hands and 22 degrees of freedom, Optimus is not just an ordinary housekeeper but a versatile assistant in every aspect of daily life. Cleaning is no longer a burden with Optimus. It not only handles cleaning tools with ease but also operates vacuum cleaners automatically, saving you time and effort. Notably, you won't have to worry about preparing an early breakfast because Optimus can quickly and easily prepare sandwiches. With its ability to learn and improve after each use, it also cleans up after cooking, ensuring your living space remains tidy and spotless. However, Optimus's capabilities go beyond household chores. It can also perform agricultural tasks such as pruning, watering, and even fertilizing. Furthermore, as previously promised, Elon Musk believes that Optimus can take on complex manual tasks like threading a needle, something even humans find challenging. Additionally, with its integrated knowledge and repair skills, Optimus can help you solve minor daily issues, such as fixing light bulbs, electrical outlets, or even alerting you to potential dangers like electrical leaks, gas leaks, or fires. This effectively and safely protects your family from harm. Therefore, we believe that $20,000 is a worthy investment for what it offers. Previously, Elon Musk stated that Optimus was initially positioned to replace humans in repetitive, boring, and dangerous tasks. However, the vision is for them to serve millions of households, such as cooking, mowing lawns, and caring for the elderly. So, don't dismiss what we've presented as nonsense or mere fantasy, as Musk has already hinted at a long-term strategic vision for his robots. Of course, these are just the features we commonly see integrated into a humanoid robot, and, currently, we can confidently say that the Tesla bot cannot perform all these functions, as it has yet to reach its final stages of utility. We hope that with the promise of delivering a few units by 2026, we will truly see the role Tesla bot will play in the real world. So how would Tesla Optimus save your money? It's no exaggeration to say that Optimus is a money-saving machine if it can perform various tasks around your home. It would be highly beneficial if we could simply purchase Optimus and have it handle income-generating tasks such as deliveries and manufacturing, thus saving a significant amount of money. This would provide us with the funds to continue purchasing additional Optimus units, maximizing our return on investment. In this way, the robots would essentially pay for themselves, eventually allowing us to buy a new Tesla EV. That's why we see purchasing the robot first as an obvious choice. We believe that the Tesla bot is not just a money-saving machine, 
but also has the potential to create business opportunities for you under the guise of labor. Workers inevitably form a workforce, and from a workforce, valuable products are always created, which can be converted into cash. As Tesla has shared about the initial mission of the Optimus robot, it was designed to perform repetitive tasks with high precision, speed, and tirelessness. This helps free humans from labor-intensive, dangerous, or mundane tasks, allowing them to focus on jobs that require creativity, skills, and higher-level strategic thinking. As a result, the overall efficiency and productivity of businesses will be significantly improved. The truth is, Tesla robots will actually be trained to create more Tesla robots. The initial robots will be used in Tesla's factory spaces, training neural networks, and accumulating thousands of hours of training data is a time-intensive process to learn and execute various tasks. Tesla's Optimus robot surpasses humans in many aspects because it can operate tirelessly all day, eliminate human error, ensure consistent accuracy in tasks, reduce workplace accidents by handling dangerous jobs, and adapt to various roles in manufacturing with advanced artificial intelligence and machine learning capabilities. Its deployment offers significant long-term cost savings, enhances overall efficiency, and provides scalability in production unlike human labor. With the Optimus robot, Tesla can expand production, meet the growing demand for its vehicles, and potentially exceed its goal of producing 20 million cars by 2030. Solid-state batteries have been hyped for years, and now companies are really in a race to make them to meet the urgent needs of the electric vehicle industry. Compared to the current gold standard of lithium-ion batteries, solid-state batteries have 60% more energy density and are 50% lighter. This is truly one of the revolutionary breakthroughs that makes them quite attractive for EVs, especially Tesla models, where weight and performance are important factors that help the company continue to lead the market. How will these batteries hit the mass market? How energy density of solid-state batteries make a breakthrough? As mentioned earlier, solid-state batteries are generally lighter and have a higher energy density. The energy density of lithium-ion batteries is around 250 watt-hours per kilogram, whereas solid-state batteries can reach nearly 400 watt-hours per kilogram. This means that, for the same weight, solid-state batteries can store more energy. This crucial factor makes them particularly attractive for electric vehicles, such as those from Tesla, helping to enhance the performance of their SUV models like the Model Y, where weight and power are critical considerations. With the compact size of solid-state batteries, the reduction in weight also plays a key role in helping Tesla cut costs and improve drag efficiency. Although there is currently no concrete evidence or claims about the range of vehicle with a solid-state battery could achieve on a single charge, it is expected that a Tesla Model Y equipped with such a battery could potentially travel a bit further than the current 300 to 330 miles per charge with its less dense battery. This potential increase in range could be enough to make a significant impact on the electric vehicle market. What is the charging rate that solid state batteries can achieve? Most people today are still reluctant to switch to electric vehicles due to the inconvenience of charging times, which remain a significant challenge. Refueling a combustion engine vehicle typically takes less than five minutes, whereas charging an electric vehicle can be a much lengthier process. However, solid state batteries appear to be a game changer in addressing this issue. Tesla's vehicles equipped with solid state batteries could potentially be fully charged in 30 minutes when using Tesla's improved fast charging stations, which have been developed over several years. The materials used in today's EV batteries, such as graphite in the anode, have physical limitations that can cause permanent damage when charged rapidly, reducing the vehicle's range. This often forces EV drivers to choose between the convenience of fast charging and preserving their battery range. As previously discussed, solid-state batteries use solid electrolytes with high ionic conductivity, which accelerates the lithium-ion transport process and speeds up charging. They can achieve up to 80% charge in 15 minutes with less detrimental effect on lifespan compared to lithium-ion batteries, though this requires various methods and future research. 
There are two common types of electrolytes in solid state batteries, sulfide and oxide. Sulfide electrolytes are noted for their excellent ionic conductivity, which enhances charging speed because ions can move through sulfide more easily than through some other electrolytes, leading to faster charging times. On the other hand, oxide electrolytes can withstand higher voltages, allowing more ions to be transported through the electrolyte layer, thereby enabling the battery to operate more efficiently at higher voltages. Additionally, some studies suggest that solid-state batteries can be charged more than five times compared to traditional lithium-ion batteries throughout their lifetime. This not only extends the battery's lifespan, but also improves its stability and long-term performance. Researchers from Harvard University have even developed a solid-state battery capable of at least 6,000 cycles and can be recharged in 10 minutes. This research not only describes a new method for manufacturing solid-state batteries with a lithium metal anode, but also provides new insights into the materials used for this potentially revolutionary battery technology. How safe are solid-state batteries? Although solid-state batteries are not yet widely commercially available and face several barriers, their solid electrolytes offer higher safety compared to liquid electrolytes, which are prone to leakage. Solid-state batteries lack these liquid electrolytes, enhancing their safety. There are still various factors that can affect the safety of solid-state batteries. The higher melting temperature in these batteries helps minimize the risk of fire under high temperature conditions. However, they are not entirely fireproof. One study found that in the case of external heating faults, solid-state batteries produce less heat than conventional lithium-ion batteries, but more than pure solid-state batteries due to a small amount of liquid electrolyte present. For short circuit faults, the heat generated depends only on the cell capacity. Since solid state batteries can have higher energy density, they may generate more heat. Typical uncontrolled thermal runaway temperatures for conventional lithium ion batteries are around 1000 to 1200 degrees Celsius. Whereas in some cases in this study, the temperature increase for solid state batteries reached nearly 1,800 degrees Celsius. The development of solid-state batteries is still evolving, but it is notable that solid-state batteries could be safer in most cases. Nonetheless, no battery system is 100% safe. Therefore, thermal management and fire-resistant materials will always be necessary to provide an additional layer to delay fire spread beyond the battery pack. How is solid-state battery production going? Unlike lithium-ion batteries, which have been mass-produced for decades, solid-state batteries have yet to find their attractive market niche. Most of the current production of these safer batteries remains at a non-standardized level, meaning they are more expensive to produce and integrate into electric vehicles. Estimates suggest that solid-state batteries can cost three to four times more than traditional lithium-ion batteries. While this may seem like bad news, we can expect prices to decrease as automakers adopt solid-state production methods. Panasonic, one of Tesla's leading battery suppliers, plans to introduce solid-state batteries for small drones and robots by 2029. Tatsuo Ogawa, Panasonic's chief technology officer, has explained that this solid-state battery technology will be used for automotive purposes representing a significant promise for Tesla's electric vehicles. And Panasonic's third battery factory in the U.S. is set to be announced soon, with the company's commitment to increase production capacity to 200 gigawatt hour by 2030 from the current limit of 50 gigawatt hour. A significant barrier is building the supply chain for solid state batteries. The battery supply chain requires high-quality materials in very large quantities, as the battery will not function even with a small amount of contamination. This indicates that it will take a long time to establish this type of battery. This is also because the broader battery field is growing exponentially, meaning that solid-state batteries are not entering a fixed market, but a market where all technologies, including traditional lithium-ion batteries, are rapidly improving. Nevertheless, solid-state batteries are not only a safer alternative, but also reduce the carbon footprint of electric vehicle batteries, potentially lowering the impact of batteries on the climate by up to 39% compared to lithium-ion batteries. 
Tesla has likely had its eye on this technology for some time, as it could address the challenging issues they have been tackling over the past decade, helping Tesla maintain its leading position in the clean energy industry and contributing to global environmental protection. However, for this technology to become a viable and widespread option, the challenges of production and cost must be overcome, and safety and performance issues must be resolved. Once these barriers are addressed, solid-state batteries could significantly reshape the clean energy industry and greatly contribute to mitigating climate change. What do you think about the potential of solid-state batteries for the all-EVs market in the future? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comment below. We hope to bring the best information to you. Please give a thumbs up if you like this, join Techno Creator by subscribing, and hit the bell icon so you will not miss out on any awesome videos. We value your feedback. Thanks for watching. Until then, stay safe and have fun.